Hi, this is Lourdes for HealingCrystals.com. Hi, this is Tara for HealingCrystals.com. Today we're going to talk about how to get the energy of crystals from either pictures, videos, or other forms of media. The internet. Exactly. Yeah. It's very simple to do. What you're going to do is you're going to look at whatever you want to get the energy from. Mm -hmm. Let's say it's the amethyst from this card. You saw it online or you own the card deck and you are going to ask the crystals in the picture to send you their vibrations. What many people find it's easy, easier to do is if you have your hands open, whether they're on your lap mm -hmm. or if some people like to put their hands up on the screen, you can do that too, but you have to breathe. No, you don't have to be deeply, just normally, and quiet yourself. See, she said breathe, and I started... <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, I have to breathe. <laughs> exactly. But we don't breathe enough. No, we don't breathe enough now. <laughs> yes, and, and this is a great way to do it, because let's face it, I post beautiful crystals, you know, that I find, uh, you know, in museums. I can't afford a couple million dollars for a crystal. Yeah. Not that, those crystals anyway. Of course anyway. not, of course not. And, and you know, well, I mean, we, we work in the field, so we mm -hmm. have a lot of crystals. Mm -hmm. Some of us have more crystals than others, but, <laughs> but anyway, you know, it's completely understandable that you can't always have mm -hmm. all of the different crystals that there are. There are so many of them, mm -hmm. which is why on our Facebook page, on our website, we post so many different pictures of them. And why, like, for instance, when I do the horoscopes, the daily and the mm -hmm. weekly horoscopes, I always post a picture with that because that picture of those of the crystals also contains the energy of the crystals and it contains the energy of the crystals working together. And, you know, we were talking before about quantum physics, about how when you observe something, even if you don't like mindfully observe something, you mm -hmm. could like just kind of walk by something and still there's a part of you that has observed it that you you connect with its energy. Exactly. And its energy connects with you. It doesn't have to be a physical connection. You don't have to actually hold something in your hand. Mm -hmm. um, you know, your relationships with people, you know, with your, with your, let's, you know, for instance, with your children, mm -hmm. all the mothers out there, you know what's going on with your children, mm -hmm. even though they may not tell you, you, but you just somehow, you know, it's, it's intuition. It's just, it's part of the connection that we all share. And sometimes you can, um, not sometimes, but using a picture enables you to, to, um, to have that connection, be able to feel it more deeply. Mm -hmm. um, you can even, honestly, I carry pictures of, of crystals on my phone. Mm -hmm. And sometimes if I need it, I'll click it on. Exactly. Um, sometimes I'll even think about a crystal. Mm -hmm. um, like, I, I have one specific grid at home that I always have running that is just for, I, I call it my wishing grid. That's where I make wishes. <laughs> okay. Why not? Um, sometimes when, when I need that energy, I'll just think about that grid. Mm -hmm. I don't even, I don't, I'm not near it, I do, I'm just thinking about it in my mind, and I can feel its energy. Um, so, you know, you don't want to, I, I think a lot of times what we do is we limit ourselves mm -hmm. um, by, by the physical, by thinking, okay, I actually have to have an amethyst to feel its energy. I need to have a big amethyst, right? How many, exactly. How many letters do we get? I want to do this. How big an amethyst do I need? Exactly. You don't need a big amethyst. You, don't, you could have a tiny amethyst. You don't need an amethyst at all. You could have a picture or a card. You could go online and look at an amethyst. You can think about what an amethyst looks like and mm -hmm. you're still going to feel that energy. It's all about your intention. Mm -hmm. It's all because we're all connected, mm -hmm. whether it's you know the unified field, universal consciousness, uh, the divine web, whatever you want to call it, we are all connected. And that enables us to call upon the energy of people and places. All this stuff is, this is I tools. Mm -hmm. this, these are all tools to help you connect. It's like a telephone, right? Exactly. If I want to talk to Lourdes, I, I don't live in her house. Mm -hmm. I pick up my phone. It's a tool for us to be able to connect. Sometimes mm -hmm. we don't even need that phone. But well, that's we don't a whole need it. <laughs> <laughs> that's a whole different connection. Um, so, so these are all tools that you can use. Even if you have an amethyst, you might want to try working with, with one of our Healing Crystals cards. 
or looking it up online, um, a, a picture of an amethyst, mm -hmm. and see how that connection feels to you. Um, you know, the, the energy the energy is always there, um, and it's always available for you to use. It, it doesn't have to be right in front of you. Doesn't have to. You don't have to be carrying it mm -hmm. with you. It's you know, it's it's up to you and your intent to establish that connection, and that's how it can work for you. Mm -hmm. And don't, you know, you mentioned a good point. You can call upon the energy of the grids we post mm -hmm. on Healing Crystals. We share some beautiful grids yes, by very talented people. Yes. And they are very powerful. Call upon them. Robin makes beautiful mandalas. Mm -hmm. Call upon the energy of the crystal and the mandala. You know, see what feels right to you. And right. I, I said see what feels, but go with whatever you connect with. And something else to consider, um, you know, and, and I always like try to say this whenever I happen to be on mm -hmm. Facebook and, and I'm talking to people that have, that have watched the videos or, or read mm -hmm. anything. When you connect to, let's say we post a Mandela and that Mandela has the energy for, for healing. Mm -hmm. When you connect to that, you're adding your energy to that as well. And that's spreading the energy out even more. So now you have become part of that healing Mandela and you're putting more positive energy out into the world. Mm -hmm. It's another way for us all to connect. And that's, that's building a community that helps us all Mm -hmm. work together and you know it, it's you know when you're you're watching this video right now your energy is connecting with ours mm -hmm. and or at least we hope, so. we hope so <laughs> or maybe you're going what click <laughs> you know, I don't know <laughs> Uh, let's. Uh, I have to say this because some. It depends on your level of sensitivity too. Because I think there are some people right now who can't, who are not at that point where they can sense the energy. They can still get it, uh, but not sense it. I would it. agree with you on that. That they that you may not be able to sense the energy, but you may not. I can hold an amethyst in my hand and not always sense exactly. the energy. Okay. Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean it's not working for you. Exactly. Okay. That doesn't mean that if, if, if you, if, if, excuse me, let me, if, if, I, hold this, if I hold this amethyst, the, this, this, yeah, it's an amethyst. It is amethyst. If I hold this, I don't have my glasses on, so it's just like a big <laughs> If I, if I hold this amethyst card, or if I say, you know what, I, I, I want this, I, I put it under my desk at work, okay, because mm -hmm. I want it to keep me conscious of what's going on around me, okay, I may not feel that energy, but that doesn't mean it's not working for me. Exactly. You don't always feel it, but that doesn't mean that it's not doing you good. Exactly. You know? But I just needed to say because I know that sometimes comes yes, up no, too. Yes, no, it's true. No, it's it's perfectly understandable. You know, because we get a lot of people say, so "Why don't I feel this?" You know, exactly. I, my hands aren't shaking or whatever yes. it is. The card's not bouncing around the table for me. It doesn't always work like that. Mm -hmm. But it does always help you, and it does always make a difference. That I can guarantee you. Exactly. For HealingCrystals.com, I'm Lourdes. And I'm Tara. Have a blessed day.